Today I'm going to show you how to set up your Evermix mix box to record two-way power with the new two-way power cable. So first of all, you're going to have your Evermix mix box case, you open it up and you'll get your mix box, your mini DIN to lightning cable and your phono cable. We'll take away the phono cable for today because I'm just going to show you how to charge. So let's take out the mix box and the mini DIN to lightning cable. Okay, we're going to insert this small top piece, if you can see that, we'll try and expose it. It's a little small dot on the top. It will go in directly in the top and you'll feel the pins aligned in with the DIN socket. You push that in and you'll hear it clip in. Okay, so you're now all set up with that. Let's move that out of the way. Now to get the two-way power, we're gonna get your plug socket and a micro USB cable. So we're going to plug the USB side into the socket and we're going to plug this into a wall behind here as you can hear. Okay, we're going to turn that on and then what we're going to do is we're going to plug this into the micro USB socket. Nice and gently. Okay, so we're going to get our iOS device. So I've got an iPhone today as you can see and then I'm just going to plug it straight in to my phone and there we go. We're all ready and we're all ready to charge and record at the same time. Um, also, you can do this as well with the um, battery pack, as you can see here. So I'll unplug the USB out of the wall socket. As you can see, now there is no charge on the device. We'll plug this into the battery pack. Oh, let's get this the right way around. Now it's on and now it's charging. So it's all simultaneously doing it at the same time. If you need any questions, just message us on our Facebook or you can contact us on support, um, support at evermix.fm and uh, one of the team will be there to help you out trying to get your device ready uh, to record and charge at the same time.